Hey what's up everyone, how are you all doing today? Welcome to episode 31 of a Let's Play series of Adeptus Mechanicus with a Heretic DLC. Last episode, we got our final Heretic mission done and kicked butt on Epsilus Damocky off. So all the Heretics are gone now. So we've just got the remaining missions from these guys left to go. Now because that mission yesterday didn't last very long, we don't have a massive amount of Blackstone. I'm pretty sure we can get one upgrade with someone. Um, so let's have a look to see who might need it. Let's check our levels first. Well, let's check if there's any we can afford one. So Jeremiah can get one. And Menarius. Mariochus. Okay, so let's give Jeremiah an upgrade, I think. We can maybe give him something to get some the better axe. Going for here. Yeah, we'll go down to that one. What have we got back yet? Yeah, we're not going to do that, are we? Okay. No, I think we'll go towards this one here. Might get those armor augments. Well, once we count the wear and give us. Oh, that gives us some energy damage. I guess we don't want them. Let's get rid of that axe. Get this one on. He's a bit more beefcake now. So, I don't want to muck around any of the easy ones today. I'd like to do a bit of a harder one. So, we've got this one here. It's going to give us a Phosphor Blaster, which doesn't look wonderful. Or this one. Yeah, that's a Croatia that's going to heal 6 HP, which is brilliant. And a level 3 Infiltrator. We'll go for that. Not quite quite as much Blackstone for this one, but there's lots of enemies, so we'll get, we'll get plenty along the way. Praetorian, Cryptic, Mortal... Lich Guard, so a warrior. Going to the Melob sector. Subdominus Kepra has requested the destruction and inscribed steel in the tomb of Melob, but depicts past victories of Necrons. Locate the steel and demolish it. Cool, shall do. Okay, what we got today then? So we've got one option, uh, one diamond encounter here, two, three. So I think we'll probably smash up do these two. It looks like we're going to have to go through that one as well. The Skitari have reported ill omens in the vicinity of the target steel. A stark example of this lies in the chamber ahead, where the walls have suddenly begun to bleed. A prodigious flow of blood sluices down the walls, gathering in the inscriptions on the floor. Defy. Traverse the chamber. It is the most direct route to the objective, and rational tech priests have no fear of such omens. Determine. Investigate the chamber to find the source of the blood. Or divert. Give the chamber a wide berth. There is no need to tempt fate by passing through it. I'm afraid I'm pretty curious here. I'd like to know why there's blood sluicing down a wall. The blood proves to have no substance at all. It is an illusion or hallucination. Though the source cannot be ascertained, the illusion is concealing several decorative panels wrought from precious metal which are duly claimed as salvaged by the cohort. So we've got some bonus blackstone. Wasn't too bad. Many female ports cover the outer shell of this Necron panel. Perhaps interfacing could improve the team's performance. So, for the first time here, we've got three, and we know that one is green and one is red. 
I would normally go for the green options, it's guaranteed, but I'd like to start sussing out what some of the other glyphs are, whether good or bad. Uh, so that was definitely not good. Took some damage. Oh well, there's only three. And I'll survive. Kill all enemies. Cool. Nice and simple. So let's see what the score is. Got the cryptic over here. The scan terminal. A little bit of cognition. The mortals. Another scan terminal and cognition. It's the lich guards. Yeah. Cognition, but no scan terminal there. A couple more cognitions here. Okay, cool. It's not bad. Go for the W setup today, I think. This Minaris. I think I'm just going to get him ready. So I've got these boys when this shield goes down. Start getting some cognition for the boys. It's just gonna hold him there. Oh, if you afford one bit more, I guess. Oh, no, don't wanna be in front of that. Um, turret. Get a butt shot. I think we can start going over here. Start nibbling on this cryptic. Oh, lots of energy armor. I think it's not worth shooting him again, then, is it? Do a little bit more. Yeah, let's give him a little bit more. Stay in there for the melee. I think we'll also move this guy in this direction. So he's got the old Coggle Kultaris on, so he's he's invisible until he makes a move uh makes an attack rather. So those two are perfectly poised. Let's have a little crack of those Lich Guards. Are you sure he's sending Leonardo's this way as well, I think? Started on these guys. So I go there. What is in melee range there? Oh, there's turrets. I think if I can pop in here, he's got line of sight in this one, but that one doesn't at the moment. And how long it stayed like that? Let's see. Hey, physical armor, cool. I'll give him another shot. Cognition. So not much around on this map. Uh, do we stick with that? Yeah, we'll stick with that. Gonna give this chap doing the same thing on. Come up for these two. Cognition freedom on. Okay, the big gun. Lovely damage. I know this axe attack isn't going to do much to him. It is going to get the, uh, the axe charged up for the machine spirit. Oh, there we go. Did, did enough. Brilliant. Um, push them away in there. 
We don't want to be doing no dilly dallying here. Oh, I don't think there's any more cognition to get. No. For now. Okay, come on, Manaris, let's start doing the business here. Is the other one going to come round? Is that going to reveal him? Uh, how much healing can he do? Five to seven. Yeah, let's heal first then. This one that's going to hurt our guy as well. So we can he do that. Use that to take him away, so it's free. Right, it seems we can't go anywhere because that force field, we may as well have a little pop of this terminal. So he's ready. Um, yeah, I guess we can heal him now. Gotta do like four encounters in this team, so we've got to make sure our guys are all topped up. Now, how shall I play this? Go. Oh, you can't. You can't get out of the opportunity attacks. Go for it, really. Let's get that Croatia on now. He should be as good as new now. Yeah, pretty much. So it's just a bit of healing. Yeah. Let's go back get our cognition first. Oh, four energy armor. Bugger. Let's see any of those guys I can. Maybe as far away as possible so he can't march up to me. Let's go over there. Um, oh, we don't have any cognition freedom. I was kind of hoping we were going to have some of that. Oh well, we've got enough points still, just about. So I'm hoping to get some opportunity. Yep. There you go, that did business. Brilliant. It's one of the triarchs down, that's brilliant. There it is. So I've only got one enemy up there. None over here. Let's get this moving a little bit more this way. Let's 
so let's move a bit more. We can poke the body, get a couple of bits of cognition back. There we go. He's got the big energy shield, isn't he? So let's not bother. What? Um. Gotta be careful. So if I go here, I'm gonna be in front of the turret, and then I'll be locked in melee combat. And I won't be able to get out of it, so I've got to be careful what direction I approach this from here. There we go. A little bit long winded. So that strips some armour away, which is quite cool. Now I can poke him away a little bit and shoot him. We might actually do a bit of damage now, because he's only got one on his armour. Yeah, that's more like it. And if we move here, so we're still in melee combat, but we're keeping line of sight open. Is there any more cognition we can get? Yeah, there we go. Let's get one of these. That's him done, I think. Yeah, I could heal him, but I'm going to wait. Let him get the shot on first. close. Pretty close. Ah, oh, look at that. I stopped in front of the turret. Oh well. Got the, uh, the damage all absorbed. It's quite lucky. I just noticed this glowy door here. I might make things interesting in a bit. Uh, heal, heal. Oh, can't heal. Gonna have to use cancel heal. So I'm not risking skipping this go. I can't I can't attack him because he's in the force field. Um okay, let's poke this body away, get back gone. Just clear up a bit here. Can okay, let me shoot him? No. Interesting. Okay, well he's just gonna have to chill there then I guess. line of sight on him from here. Does that reach? Oh yeah. Pistol's got some range on it. Got freedom. Yes. You gone. Cool. Now, uh, there's no scan terminal. Yeah, I've already blown it up. Yeah, let's use our scan. Oh, I look like one, one space away from getting the cognition. Ah, oh, bum. Oh, I wonder if we can get this one up here. No, two spaces away. Get the old school way then. Ah, oh, I clicked on the lemon turret there. Sass and frassins. Now, I bet he's an opportunity there. Yeah, even though. You can't attack. That's a load of nonsense, isn't it? It seems as well to skip as well, really. Um, can't do anything all the time. I got stuck in the force field. Is that blowing up? Oh, let's go have a little pop of that then. Got a cognition stick as well. Oh, didn't realise we've actually done it. Okay. Um can get eyes on no. Come on. Thank you. He definitely needs to heal up, though. Get some more goodness in your son. Oh, 
Oh, no, I thought that was the healing one. So he can attack us whilst he's in the force field, but we can't attack him. That's just great with that. Is. I've only got one enemy, no point getting any troops in now. Give me some more of this. Flame on. Check. Even though that flame attack didn't do any damage, we've got the opportunity of him to keep the burn damage on him. And hopefully it should, yeah, there we go, drag him over towards us. I think Naris' axe is all charged up now. Yes, nice. Let's give him a little poke. I hope they do the business. If it doesn't, no, but it does. There we go. Then we got a little mechandendroid. Oh no, we don't need to poke him because that was the last one. There we go. of Mars. One of the cohorts suddenly doubles over in the centre of this chamber, moaning in pain. They retch up a writhing metallic lump that splits into dozens of tiny necron scarabs which scuttle across the floor. The sudden, violent infestation is horrific and disorienting. Sacrifice. Execute the affected trooper. Oh dear. Save. Attempt to give medical assistance to the stricken trooper. Or secure. Pin the affected trooper down in case of a turn on the rest of the cohort. Um, I want to try and save him. As the cohort attempts to administer neuroparalytics and prepare for xeno-extraction surgery, the scarabs disappear and the infested trooper returns to normal. The scarabs were a hallucination brought on by proximity to the target steel. The trooper has avoided injury the strange influence of the steel is illustrated further. Brilliant. So we've got some blackstone. Didn't kill our dude, but didn't need killing. Bit of a result. Alright, let's get into the next room. Let's see what we can do here. Kill all enemies again. Okay. I'm going to keep these guys huddled in there, I think, just in case someone here gets an angle on them. Although, these Praetorians, yeah, Praetorians are just going to jump in anyway, aren't they? Mortal, Lich Guard, Praetorian, Lich Guard, on scan terminal, these couple of cognition points. Okay, cool. He's got a Vanguard guy in as well. Probably get our is it infiltrator or rust stalker in next turn when we got through the force field. I think. Okay, Manaris. Let's heal yourself up a little bit. In fact, no, I'm gonna wait until it's uh, Jeremiah's turn. I'll get a bit of a group heal on. Could get line of sight on that guy there. I think I'm gonna go up this way. Move towards these two. So that's the other Lich Guard there. We want him. Oh, that's not West End yet. Um, no, we'll wait. We'll wait on all of that. Oriochus. Okay, so here's the dude that's got a gun that can do a bit of damage. Sort of. Potentially. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Physical armor. Let's get another shot in. Cool, let's get him out of the way now. Troop unit. There we go. Give our vanguard the buff he needs. Cool, that one's all good. Uh, so I might do the same as what I did last time with this chap. Send him out with Minarius to help with the Lich Guard. Oh, yeah, 
let's move them up a bit further because we can. Collect one cognition. There we go. Let's get our little one there. He's already now. Can he heal himself a bit? Yeah. That's a free heal, so it's worth spending. Vanguard guy. He's got physical armor, so he's not going to want to try him. But from over here, I've got eyes on the Lich Guard. So let's barrel into him a bit. I don't know whether these shots are doing damage or getting absorbed, but let's get him in there. He's gone red, so he's a bit angry, so he must have done something. What guns we got here of Leonardus? Yeah, more energy. Brilliant. Let me blow out this guy a bit more. Brilliant, got rid of the Praetorian, I hate them. Jumping about all over the shot. Let's keep him in the blue. Oh, in fact, no, we don't need to. We've got quite a bit of cognition at the moment. Just stick with that, but we do want to get the heal on, don't we? Get everyone topped up a bit. So can he get eyes? Oh, he can get eyes on this one over here on the Lich Guard. Oh, so we can't get him with that one to see what the stats are. So let's get our energy enhancers on. Get every little bit of damage we can into this guy. Oh, he's going to do a bit of damage to the Immortal as well. Brilliant. That's quite a result there. So he's got Sand of Nova stats. Hey, he just walked out of range of that. Brilliant. Okay, so I was going to get my Rust Door print, and I'm not lying. Let's get that sucker down. Minarius here. Let's get in position for a wild time little flame shot. And we can get all sorts of cognition here, so we saved the servo skull. Uh, I'm not going to spend cognition freedom on the flame for I think I'm going to use it for the other gun. Oh, nice! Nice, let's go down. That was not expected. Definitely not using the other gun now, then. Especially because he's got all the energy armor going on. Alright, if we position ourselves here, not only are we in melee combat with him, but when the cognition comes back on that terminal, we'll be all ready for it. Opportunity attack madness. Can I? No. Um, let's do this so we can kite and pass these guys. Get, in fact, we want to go back a bit further for that. Still seeing from there? Yeah. Try and kite and pass these two chaps. opportunities in there. Oh, nine. 
job or got me some healing, goodness. Keep him there, I think. Can you get that? Nah, a bit too far away. Oh, I can do this sneaky one though. Haha, <laughs> go the hell. Brilliant. There's glowy doors up here. I wonder if anything's going to come out of them. Um, let's push one of our guys up a bit. Armor. So let's first give him brat for this gun here so it ignores the armor. Just like I can finish him off here. Let's give him a little poke first. Quick one. Poor old Rustor didn't get any action though. I've got lots of hallucinations going on. Do you reckon my guy's been in some mushrooms or something? In the chamber ahead is a gaggle of hungry looking and distressed civilians pleading for help from the cohort to escape the tomb. Credulous, assist the civilians on the minuscule chance they are real. Barbarous, rake the chamber with gunfire. This illusion must be hiding some lurking Necron threat. Or suspicious, avoid the chamber, leaving the civilians behind and ignoring their cries for help. Uh, I don't want, definitely don't want to go for the barbarous one, in case they're real. Suspicious. I feel I might traumatise my guys, thinking they might have left behind some civilians. So I think we're going to try and see what happens. The cohort enters the chamber, eager to escort the civilians out of the tomb. The image of the sobbing innocents vanishes, replaced with an automated gauss flare turret that hammers them with fire. The cohort is forced to scatter, to tend to their wounds and curse for the deceitfulness of the Necrons. Oh, we lost some HP there. At least we've got a nice clear conscience, eh? Let's go glyph room. A single port designed for a Necron Canoptic creature extrudes from the device. Initiative decreased. Cool. Let's get into this one. Kill the red guys. Cool. Kill all enemies. We can do that. Let's have a look. Is that immortal? Yep, got immortal. Lich guard. Lich guard. Quick tech. Warrior, immortal. Warrior. Scan terminal here. Cognition, cognition. Is it just that one scan terminal? Just that one cognition terminal, too. Oh no, there's that one's out of the two. So, what's the plan going to be here then? So there's only about one in there. There's only an immortal. So I think we might send the rest of the guys. Should we split? Yeah, I think we'll split. We'll take some up both both directions, I think. So let's just see. We get two there. Two there. One in the middle. And this poor um this poor rust over here keeps on coming along and not getting any actions, so we'll get the rust orchid and straight out for that. Oh no, this isn't gonna muck about. Should have poked it first. Whoopsie. Let's get all of them. 
and make up for it a little bit. Now, can I get eyes on these guys? Eyes on two of them. Is it not an I can get... F there we go. That's what we're talking about. Multiple engagements at once. Oh, yeah. Well, let's just check, actually. Yeah, <laughs> maybe not then. Bombs. How far off is it? Go for right distance, just the angle, isn't it? I don't think there's any way I'm going to get all of them. Okay. I'm just got to concentrate on these two then. Um, yeah. He's only got two, so let's try and take him out with a little cheapo stabby stick. Get some more cognition from him, thank you very much. Go up to this mofo. Oh, don't want to poke him yet. Should we... Is there any way we can... No, let's just spend it. Do it. He's gone as well. Bye. Let's move down here for a bit of safety, possibly. There you go, what a, what a little turn from an hour is there, that's brilliant. Oh, before I forget anything, you're going to heal. Is this Oriochus? Yes. Let's give our little trip unit here some love then. Just gonna have to wait there. Coming force fields. Is that the lips go? It is, isn't it? Oh well, let's just do it. Um, in fact, is that one gonna attack Cryptek? Yeah, let's do this one first. So when I shoot him, he's gonna start coming towards us. So I'm shooting with this gun first. At least he's gonna get a little bit of damage knocked on that Cryptek. Reduces his movement as well, so he might not be able to march quite as far towards us. In fact, he's not even tried to march towards us. Brilliant. Why is that? I don't can complain, but it's just a bit odd. Uh, okay, collect one cog point. No, no, I had to collect cog points from. We haven't got any dead ones. Oh, do you have one there? Is he? No. Let's reveal some stats, eh? See what we're messing with. I just think of these days, eh? He's blocking the path as well. Just gonna spend an extra cognition point just to get him out of the way there, I think. There you go, so now this guy's actually gonna have line of sight. You have it from there, though. Does but it's not going to do anything. It says that's not going to do anything. Blimey, he's got a lot of shield, isn't he? Is that this one here? Seven. Yeah. Okay. Plonk of her. I'll just keep him chilling there for the moment. Quite interesting though. Shooting the Lich Guard with that guy and he didn't move forward. But shooting with this guy, he's further away, and he did try and move forward. Interesting mechanics there. Right, I think we'll do. I'll send this guy around to try and back up Manaris. Oh, I think he really needs it at the moment, but there's still a Lich Guard up here. Let's just use that and get one of them out of the way, I think. And we get the servo skull on this one. Okay, so both these guys have got massive energy armor. Go and wait 
for that four straight away. Cool, eight damage, that's a fair hit. Ten, woohoo! Go on, Minaris. Oh, that one hasn't opened. What? Bugger. Okay, well, let's um get our other troop in to try and get down a hill. Hang in the butt. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do that. Let the Lich Guard come in. Should I have healed him first? No, he's got 11, he'll be alright. Not enough cognition. Ah, oh, Martin's made a boo boo. Oh dear. Seems that fourth field is going to take forever to open. May as well move this guy a little bit. He can't collect any cognition from anything. Can this guy? Here we go. This guy's got a pokey stick and he's got full health. Do this one for now, so it's free. We haven't got much cognition. Ugh, human cryptic. damage on him at least. Let's see what his stats are. Energy armor, okay. Uh, we got we don't have no cognition freedom. Collect one. And just collect one. I don't want to spend that really. Not oh, him anyway. Let's try and shoot this um, crypto. He's bugging me. Oh. He's okay for health, isn't he? See if we can shoot this guy, get the opportunity attack, and drag him away from Minarius. Oh, I didn't. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Thought it was going to make it all the way over to me. That's cool. Go on, do the deed, do the deed. Yes. Can't poke anything, can we? I'm poking. Yeah, we can poke him. Get rid of him. Yeah, we should be able to come up here and heal Minaris up a bit. 
we go. Oh, I feel a bit better now. Uh, I could use our cognition freedom. I don't think I'm gonna. Let's just um wait for another unit's turn. We healed him at perfect timing, didn't we? Blimey. Nope. We need every bit of cognition we can get at the moment. Hmm. Shielding has this guy got? No, so we don't know what shielding this guy's got just yet. Energy. Let's give him a little poke. That's machine spirit charge, so this should. Yeah, deal some good damage. There we go. Jobs are good in the back one. Now let's get these cog points here. Now we're sitting pretty a bit better now. Let's send them around here. Please don't hit my guy. Oh yes. Bye bye, Cryptech. Let's send them back this way. This guy's had a little bit of a to and fro. Oh, energy. Okay, let's just get in there and whack him. So I didn't kill him, but when he tries to move away from us, we'll get the opportunity to attack him. Oh, let's do that as well. Let's get in there. Didn't do anything? No. So yeah, let's stay next to him. Keep the opportunity to attack going. Maybe we could use a cognition. No. No, no. Let's heal him up before he does anything else. Hope his axe charged up now. Yes. Yeah, a good bit of armor strip in there. From the bar. Um, does this one damage? No, it doesn't. We really need to get rid of some of these units over here. Yeah, she shoot these. Here, haven't we? Yeah, that one's gonna reanimate at the end of this turn. That would put a bit of spanner in the works. Let's heal everyone up first. One more encounter to do after this. I want to make sure we're all topped up. There we go. So I've just got this one here to nobble. And he can't go anywhere, so that was still got him blocked in. Can we get eyes on him? Yeah, we can. Um, 
Right, it's gonna do for business. Let's. Oh, it's gonna hurt our guy though, isn't it? Oh no, our guy's got energy shield, energy armor, so we're okay. Brilliant. All right, three down, one to go. Cool. Or well, Xenos life forms purged. Blackstone. Minus four to be awakening. And we've got some healing on as well. Brilliant. That's a bonus. Let me skip past the glyph. That's weird. Once again, kill everything. Lich Guard Immortal. Mortal. Mortal. Torian. Warrior. Only one Lich Guard. But we do have six glowing doors. And as the stairs leading up to the middle here, nothing there. That's pretty much guaranteed to be a platform, isn't it? Right, this Rust Stalker is going to get some battle. At some point, it's going to get in the action. I'll make sure I keep remembering to poke these terminals before I chop them, but... So hopefully when that platform comes up that's going to have cognition on it. Before I forget, let's get our troop buffed. I don't block this off with the other units. Okay. I'm locking a seven energy armor at the moment. Get the defense out for the boys. I'm going to give him some physical armor. There we go. I think that's quite a good idea. Can we go there. Oh, that's doable. No, that one. Let's do this one. Guard already. Got some little bits of cognition. Uh, no, we're not going to get any more interest yet, I don't think. Minaris. So let's put him here. Oh, 
Oh yeah, he counts as still in the bubble, even though he's pretty much only got a foot in. Well, that's brilliant. Come on, mate, let's have it. Yeah, stripped a load of armor and did a whole pile of damage. Lovely. It's a good little round with him. He's only got five health left. Let's have a go then, eh? Yeah, that's going to do it. Look at that. One Lich Guard down without taking any damage from him. That's fantastic. Okay, so we've got another one just there. Can we get a line of sight on this guy? We can nip out just a bit, we can. Um, I'm going to leave him there. See if any more of my guys have got Cognition Pokey Sticks first. Oh, perfect. Physical armor. Uh, this is the last encounter, isn't it? So let's start using some canticles. Try and get these enemies knocked down a little quicker. Oh, 15. Yeah, that's brilliant. Troops there. Can I use that? No. Okay. Okay, so here we go. He's got a pokey stick. Get some cognition. Thank you. here actually. So that's going to be more annoying. Damage, but he had like four physical armor. Thought it was only gonna scratch him. Yet again, that is quite fantastic. Um there we got lots of yeah, lots of cognition. Kinda lots of cognition. Not that many enemies yet, so let's have a go at him. I still move. Yeah, let's get out of the way. Just top our health up a little bit, because that's a freebie. Here you go, this guy's got a pokey stick as well. Even that body there's proved to be quite a good shout. as well. Oh, let's get rid of him now. Is this a guy? Yeah, the physical armor. So all these energy attacks should do good. I want to get him with that. Is that going to hurt all of our guys? It's going to hurt two of them here. Let's go for this one instead. You never know. We might get to kite back Lich Guard past a couple of our guys, possibly. God, 
his movement is reduced now, isn't it? Cool. Yeah, let's give this guy a little, a little chop. I don't think he's going to do much because he's got lots of armor. At the very least, we're going to charge our axe up for the machine spirit. Hey, the rust orc is actually going to get the play. Cool, five damage is good. Happy with that. Forgot about that one over there. Oh, that's an angle. Nice. I love those opportunity attacks. Oh, another Lich Guard and Cryptek. Let's get another troop unit in then. Aha, there we go. Get all three of the suckers. I don't want to do this one now, but I think I might get my butt kicked. Because both of these two are coming for a counter attack, and I don't think that's going to be a good idea. Yeah, I might just give this one here another whack. step do healing first I'm going to shoot this lich guard hope to get the old uh, opportunity attack I do know what he's got he's got seven NG armor so it's not worth trying to get him with the other gun this is literally just provoking past Minaris there we go jobs are good in there We need to do something similar with this guy now, really. We've got deals one damage and troop unit stuff. Let's give the vanguard a little bit of a buff. Hope some cognition back from here. Then, I don't know, did we try and antagonize this one? Do we know what armor he's got? I've got no idea. Let's have a go at that guy. We can nearly kill him with a shot. Is that? No. Oh, let's go and get this cryptic. I don't like quick decks. Okay, 
Van Gogh guy, Van Gogh guy. Put him here. Let's see if we can do a bit of glitch guard kiting. He does have reduced movement, so he might not make it very far. Oh, here we go, he's got one opportunity. We're gonna get another one here. Not yet. Let's try again from here. Hey, let's go down. Suck on that. Oh, you gotta go upstairs to get in there. Let's see. What we got then? Don't have a pokey stick with this guy. Also, don't have any cognition freedom. Bit of a bugger. Get one extra, I guess. Go there. So I'm dead. Core six. So close. Do we finish him off? He's only got one. Oh, I wonder if that does damage. Haha, <laughs> Service Skull does one damage. Let's do it. Come on. Hey, love it. So I haven't killed much yet. Oh well, let's use him just to wipe up some of his bodies so we don't reanimate. Can't get this one, he's all beyond the force field. Oh, there we go. He's got some health on him. Oh, another Lich Guard and Cryptic. This is never ending. Oh dear. Right. Let's start getting rid of these. We're going to get reanimation soon. Oh, what's over here? Is that cryptic? Yeah, it's a cryptic. Okay. Going that way gets us some cognition. bit more of that good stuff. Oh, he's nearly dead already. One opportunity attack and he's gone. Um, yeah, we've got a little stabby stick here. Let's give him a little stabby. Let's see if we can get up here and Knob of his cryptic. How much else he got left to you? Yeah. Mm. yeah, let's just hope that that does the damage. 
We want. Ah, oh well. He's still only on one HP, it's good. Back off a bit and go for Glitch Guard, I think. In fact, now we've got a um, Praetorian there that's been floating around for ages. Let's get him so he doesn't jump around anywhere. Good job, sir. Good job. Machine spirit charge, let's make the most of it. Oh, we might have got an opportunity there. Horatio here to heal up Minaris a bit. Okay, so that's not in front of the turret there, is it? No. Pretty close, but not quite. Cool, another one butts dust. Some more cognition back for Pokey Stick. Um, I think we'll take this Cryptarch out actually with a Pokey Stick. It's been dead for a little longer. And a big negative on the reanimations. Well, my guy has got full health, so I'm going to get in there, give us a Lich Guard, what for? This is your moment. <laughs> oh, it actually did it as well. Oh, yeah. Finally paid dividends. Mission complete. The target still takes up one entire wall of a huge chamber. It depicts Necron victories, along with countless atrocities inflicted on conquered Xenos. The cohort place explosive charges that rip it from the wall and smash it into thousands of shards. The hallucinations surrounding the steel cease, and the area becomes a little more bearable for the Skatari to operate in. Isn't that lovely? a bit of blackstone over 200 there but I think we're going to get plenty back from all the enemies we've killed so we, that's four different encounters there lots of enemies so this should just keep ticking away for a bit ok look at all of that stack up there we go look at that good old Croatia but hill 6 and that's a free to use one which is awesome Got a level 3 infiltrator. 
We'll see. Last bit of blackstone. No new canticles. Let's have a little cheeky look on our cohort. See if it'll let us... No. Stupid things up here again. Can't have a look at what our extra perk is on our guy. Oh well. We'll have to wait until the next one for that. So there we have it guys. We've got a nice bit of blackstone from there. Mission to... to yeah. Bit longer today than normal, but we did have four encounters to get through, so I think hour and 15 is still not too bad, really, because it's a hard one as well. So I hope you've enjoyed that. Please leave us a like and subscribe if you did. Stay tuned for the next one, and in the meantime, enjoy the rest of your day. Take care.